it's a very exciting time right now because we can look towards next year to see the, uh, the uh, release of data from two or three major clinical trials. The first phase three clinical trial of cell therapy for patients with cardiomyopathy and heart failure is completed enrollment and we ex we're expecting those results next year. There's also a very exciting trial called the Concert HF trial, which was funded by the National Institutes of Health. It looks at a unique way to combine two types of cells to try and enhance the effect. So we're calling that now combina combinatorial cell therapy for patients with, with ischemic cardiomyopathy and heart failure. Well, congestive heart failure, the underpinning of congestive heart failure is some kind of injury or damage to the heart. In most instances, or many instances, let's say, it's, it's a heart attack where uh, blood flow has stopped to the heart muscle and a part of the heart muscle has died, leaving a scar. That scar then causes a process of remodeling of the, of the left ventricle, and the, the, the ventricle can blow up like a balloon. In other words, um, the normal shape of the heart is a football, and that can become a basketball after a uh, myocardial infarction. When that occurs, there's all kinds of health issues that, that result. So in, in the most advanced cases, we try to transplant that person, take the old injured heart out and replace it with a new one. But the whole idea of cell therapy is that we can fix that injury without having to remove the whole organ and just sit, simply inject the cells into the areas that need it, the areas of damage and injury, and allow those areas to heal and regrow some functioning heart muscle. So that's the goal. No, no, certainly, certainly if you develop any new therapy for a new area, it has to be targeted and focused on a specific type of disease. We are doing a variety of trials now and in the future that are targeted to a number of the key areas of, of need. One would be ischemic cardiomyopathy, which is the patient I've mentioned a couple of times, the patient that's had a heart attack and now has had a remodeled ventricle. That's a, that's a key area of focus. Another area of focus is a person or a patient that has what's called idiopathic cardiomyopathy. The heart is not functioning and is injured uh, due to reasons other than a heart attack. And there's another important area that we're currently doing a study on, which is children who have congenital heart disease. These are kids who are born with uh, dysfunctional hearts, and these are very seriously ill kids, and they need a lot of surgery. But we're doing a study now to see if adding cell therapy into those surgical procedures can help the hearts heal and stay strong.